What's going on, y'all, man? It's L.A. Rich, and we back with another video, man. And look, we got the Notorious Duo back on this channel, man, with another goddamn new video. We got Tom McDonald and Adam Calhoun, Grace Ward. Now, let me tell y'all, I had did a reaction to the promo of this whole entire album, and I I didn't know that, they, that he be dropping some albums on a specific uh, website and not YouTube or nothing, so... It was definitely caught me off guard, and I was wondering when I'm be able to even react to a new song from it. But y'all had let me know that he does eventually drop a song or drop a couple songs from the album on YouTube with a whole video and everything. So I was expecting it to come in like maybe two, three months, and out of nowhere, y'all let me know earlier this week that he does actually have one coming out on this damn friday so it has surprised me for sure but we 100 percent got it on um ready to react to now you feel me and i'm excited for it most definitely so um nonetheless i want to say before i even get into the vid i want to say um thank y'all again for helping me hit 5.6 thousand subscribers we done wrote the 5.7 now i appreciate every last one of y'all for the love and support y'all show me on a day-to-day -day basis it truly me the most to me nonetheless we gonna go ahead and get into this vid. Y'all make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some more videos to react to. And by the way, I have a whole Tom McDonald playlist of every reaction I've did um, in the past, I think, four, five months. It's like 80 of them on there. So before y'all request anything, make sure to go check out the playlist. If you don't see what you want on there or see a song that you wanted me to react to, go ahead, comment it, and I got y'all with it. But nonetheless, Let's go ahead and get into the video, man. It's okay to be racist. As long as you hate on the Caucasians. Teaching white kids that their shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm tripping because the white children have Wait, hold on. He didn't, he didn't start saying some real shit already. Hold on. It's okay to be racist. As long as you hate on the Caucasians. Teaching white kids that their shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm tripping because the white children have been getting taught that they got white privilege by the white guys in the high heels who identify as the white women. I'm not proud to be white, but I'm fine with it because I'm not allowed to have pride in it. Oh shit, hold on. Wait, he taking off already. Wait, hold on. What he said right there? It ain't black. It ain't black or white. Left and right is good and evil. Wait, hold on. Let me hear it again. All these folks hate normal people. It ain't black or white. Left and right. Good and right. It's good and right. It ain't good and right. It's good and evil. All these folks hate normal people. That right there is a fact, man. You feel me? Quit looking at shit from what it is when it comes to just a damn color. Because at the end of the day, it is just a damn color, man. And I said it in one of my past videos, too. Every all, The only thing that changes us, we all people. Every single one of us is a person. We didn't all came out and we were born to be a person. But the one thing that changes is our damn mind. That's the only thing. Every single one of us is the same. But the one thing we have different in that give us, that make each other different from each other, is that damn thing that's in the top in your head, man. That motherfucking brain. That's it. That is literally it, man. It, it's crazy how much that, uh, that can, that this thing right here can mess up a whole entire world with their thought process and everything, straight up. Label me Hitler and hate like I'm wearing a clan hood. It ain't left or right or black or white, it's good and evil. I leave folks hate normal people. United we stand and divide we fall. America, we gotta get real. You were segregated, that was not fair. You were enslaved, they did not care. But you were never on a plantation, and my generation was not there. That's trauma in your DNA. Causing what mm. we see today. I pray to God you stay in strong. Don't want to see no man in pain. Your white folks have been buried. Some of y'all are such parents. That, that is true, too. You know, a lot of people be bringing up the shit that, um, when it comes to. 
black people, shit, I even see uh, Hispanics bringing up too about how they were on a plantation and, you know, everything just about slaves and everything like that. And it is most definitely from our DNA and shit because our ancestors did have to go through it, but we blessed enough to not have to do that in this generation. You feel me? And that's what, that's exactly that everything about our, the past these people in current day want to live it on like like it's something that they had to go through or something bro and i'm not talking I'm, I'm talking about even other races that's just trying to dictate how they feel on certain races like people trying to dictate how they feel on black people or some or people trying to dictate how they feel on white people hispanics or something like that just because of what happened in the damn past you were not there for it you were not so why the hell is you letting shit like that change on how you feel about something you feel me like shit don't make no sense to me bro God, you staying strong don't want to see no man in pain your white folks i'm embarrassed some of y'all are such karens that prejudice you inherited was racism from your parents get that poison out your veins whites and blacks are all the same they want us in our graves just let me try to explain Thanks. Oh shit. Man, that's one thing about Adam and Tom, man. They gonna say the brutal, but real shit. You can always count on them for that. They gonna always speak it real and how it's supposed to be spoken. No if ends or trying to hide shit. None of that. They gonna keep it real. But you seen what he said, though. Listen. That's, if you listen to the news, you're going to believe all this is true. Man, oh man, when I tell you, the news is the worst place to get any information from because you, you people forget what the damn news is doing. That is a whole corporation, a whole platform that get paid when they viewers are watching. And what do people want to gravitate to and watch? When they see bad shit happening, you don't never see nobody talking about the good shit. You don't never see the news bringing up no good shit because what does that do? It don't dr bring in people as much as bad shit do. So they obviously going to highlight all the negative bad shit that's going on for the simple fact of it's going to keep people watching, man. So never look at the damn news for no type of information. I damn know when he trust them for the weather, if I'm being honest, you know, but hey. That's straight how it is. By police, even when you follow the rules, if you listen to the news, you're gonna believe all this is true. True, I ain't feel no white guilt. They don't lie for me when I'm killed. I guess white life don't matter, sad, but that's the way that I feel. I feel like they mm. feel like, like I don't know what they all call me. Cis, white, male, bigot, racist, he's a Nazi, that's not me. I'm not one of these white liberal commies who think black America needs allies in they on me. Your neighborhood's all gay and claim you pro black, but you faking guys are dying on the pavement. All your hashtags won't save them, that ain't gangster. Mm. Wait, hold on. Adam going crazy on this. Hold on. Wait, hold on. What'd he say? Every color turns to bones one day when you bury them. Every color turns to bones one day when you bury them. And that goes back to me saying the shit about all of us being the same besides our brains and our head. Every color will turn to bones when you bury them, man. We are all the same again, bro. That shit need to get through motherfuckers' head more than it said, man. We is all the same, man. Every color turns to bones one day when you bury them. Whites and blacks are all the same. 
They want us in that grave, just let me try to explain I swear they want us in a race for dying every hey. day Hey, hold on. Look at that switch up, though. I like that. Race war dying in the streets should be us against them. But it's you against me. Ain't nobody gonna win. Everybody gonna see that the color of your skin don't change the color that you bleed. I swear they want us in a race war dying. And I like this song, bro. Great song, man. Truly great song. Straight up. And y'all know, I wait to the end now because I don't want to miss nothing, especially since it's a new video. But, man, I'm going to be honest, overall great song, man. I, if I'm being honest, I, I might put this in my top 10. I like this song a lot, really. Everything about it, the message, the vibe, the switch-ups in it with the vocals and all that, man, it was a great song, straight up. But, nonetheless, thank y'all again for helping me hit five point. 6,000 subscribers, run up to 5.7 now. I thank every last one of y'all for the love and support y'all show me on a day-to-day -day basis. It truly means the most to me. Nonetheless, that's going to close out the video. Y'all make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some videos to react to. And it's LA Rich, and I'm getting up out of here. All right, ciao. Pockets filled with money, bitch, like fucking